From the Housing Central homepage, you can see the Housing Self-Selection section at the bottom of the page. You can click Open or click Housing Self-Selection at the top of the page. Prior to the start of your selection time, you'll be able to enter self-selection and browse available rooms. A countdown clock shows you how much time is left before your selection appointment time begins. In the My Group section, Harriet still has the ability to promote Jane to the group leader or remove Jane as a member of the roommate group. Being able to change the group leader is really helpful if your selection time conflicts with the group leader's academic or personal schedule. Before your selection appointment time begins, you can click Select a Room to browse all assignments still available in self-selection. You can click the Open Room buttons to view information about the assignment, including pictures. You can see that each room has a little star next to it, and you can click the star next to the space you're interested in to mark them as your favorite. Your favorited spaces will appear on the right for easy access once your selection appointment begins. You can see that there are open room buttons in both blue and white. A blue open room button indicates that there are enough spaces available to house all of your roommates. Rooms with a white button can't accommodate the roommate group. We can't favorite a room with a white button, which means that if one of your favorited rooms is selected by other students, it'll no longer appear in your favorites list to the right. Should Owen Hall room 104 has a white open room button, and you can see that there's already a student assigned to this room, so there's not enough spaces available for you and your roommate. Once the countdown clock reaches zero, you can click refresh to open the page again and see a new clock counting down the amount of time you have left to select a space. Now when you click on a blue open room button, you can see a new option to assign yourself and your roommates to the available spaces within the assignment. When you found the space you want to select, assign your roommates to the available spaces and are ready, click Finalize Selection. Another box will pop up where you can click OK to confirm and secure your space. Once you finalize your space, you won't be able to change your room selection, so be sure of your choice before you finalize. Now you can see your room assignment information for the upcoming year. Congratulations, you've just completed housing self-selection. Students selecting their assignment as an individual will complete these same steps for self-selection. If you don't see any assignments that have enough spaces available for everyone in your roommate group, you can return to the Update Roommates section and remove members from your roommate group or create new smaller roommate groups. Just remember that priority for your self-selection time is based on the member of your roommate group with the highest earned credit hours. So if you break up your group, reform new groups, it's possible that your selection appointment time will change based on the credit hours of your new roommate groups or your own credit hours if you decide to select a room as an individual. The appointment times are dynamic and change as the roommate group members change. If you have any questions about selecting an assignment, be sure to reach out to the Residential Living and Learning Office for assistance.